What is up YouTube? It's your boy Unboxing. I am back with another unboxing of the Air Jordan Retro 4 Metallic Purple. <laughs> Before we get into the thick of things, if you're new to this channel, welcome. Be sure to spam that like button, subscribe, and also be sure to follow your boy on IG at Unbox Sneaks. But as you saw my video not too long ago about me actually copying the metallic purple retro force. The sun came in the mail today. Your boy finally got the package so on the box it reads well for one your boy finally got the box so it's gonna be plain white Air Jordan box with the purple accents purple jump man here purple jump man here and of course underneath you're gonna have the purple writing um, on the tag it reads Air Jordan Retro 4, white, court purple, black, violet purple. And your boy's a size 10 and a half. Retail, 190 beans. All right, so you're gonna have your white paper. Nothing too, nothing too jazzy about the box. Uh, it, it honestly matches the shoes, if I must say, simply because you're literally paying for smidgets of color on this shoe. But, got the shoe in hand. And I must say, the leather on this shoe is pretty good. Pretty good. So you're gonna have, <clears throat> so just to kind of dive into things, actually this pair, is really tumbled. I'm actually feeling that. So it's not much to dive into when it get when you talk about these shoes. It's so much white going around it, you know. So it's a very easy pair to just kind of go through a quick run through with. But you're gonna have that white toe box, as I mentioned. Uh, one of the pairs, which is the right shoe, is gonna be a bit more tumbled than the actual left pair. So you can kind of see that. You know, so that so that's gonna be some of that, some of that good leather, some of that good leather. And then on this shoe, which is the left, it's not as tumbled, uh, but I still think both of these joints ride. This one's gonna have more of the tumbled on that front uh, toe box side panel. So, and then even as you go up into the side of the shoe and make your way to the back, to that booty, uh, it's still gonna have that tumble man honestly guys i think this is a dope shoe to rock if um if the pandemic wasn't going on right now it is a clean white shoe um i think it will be a great shoe to rock over the summer uh maybe start in the spring late spring early summer rock throughout the entire summer and then probably you will put it away uh as the fall begins to approach just because you know the color shifts and I just think it's just too much white to try and maintain uh, for multiple uh, or maybe to maintain for a few seasons. Uh, but as you get to the back, you're gonna have that metallic or if they call it violet, metallic, violet, purple uh, jump man. Um, it's gonna also have that reflective piece on it as well. So it's pretty nice actually. I'm not too, uh, I'm not too big on fours, honestly. I um, am trying to get into fours, and I, I'm a huge three guy. But fours, and some would say, one boxed. The threes and the fours basically almost the same thing. And that's debatable. That's debatable. You know, um, even on the side pieces, you're gonna have that purple, purple, purple here. And as well as the gate is gonna be, uh, which is gonna go around the entire shoe. I think that's the piece of the shoe that I'm not really feeling for real. I've never been too fond of fours when it comes to that. Um, 
but hey different strokes to different folks and then you are going to have that purple jump man on the tongue that reads flight underneath so that's going to be your traditional uh retro four tongue and then you flip it in the inside and it's going to say air jordan so both of the shoes are going to pretty much have that exact same uh detail those exact same features of course you're going to get your shoe tree that you get with all of the retro jordans um one one indicator that i actually found out is that your shoe tree it actually has the size or the size range of what the sneaker should be so for instance for those of you that shop on gold and stock x um make sure that your shoe trees line up make sure it has that size so this is a ten and a half so this shoe tree is going to be um applicable to size 10 and size 10 and a half um it's gonna be purple insole with the white jump man again it's just those splashes of purple um and then of course the uh aglets are gonna be clear those are gonna be the pieces on the uh, tips of the shoelaces if you did not know and those are aglets uh, and then underneath you're gonna have your turd stain of purple up here uh, and then you're gonna have your little baby jump man right underneath here so both are gonna be those hints of purple my overall opinion of these shoes I think they're clean you know um, I think you're gonna get kind of, I know people are, you know, I know the red pair is highly sought after. I think you're gonna get the same thing with no matter what pair it is. Now, uh, from my latest update, I did see that we should be getting the uh, metallic red pair on June 20th in the United States. So that is gonna be good, man. Those prices on StockX and Gold are ridiculous, man. You talking about, I know from my size, I think they at least going for like, a rack and I'm like no sir no sir but um I know these joints sold out like immediately again I was able to hit two pair on these I'm sure you guys can guess which pair this is where did it come from DTLR of course your boy got another email from Nike about a shipping delay last night for my other pair of metallic purples but nevertheless, I do have good news. I finally got my second pair of Royal Toes in today. Today. Now, the, those joints came out earlier this month. And I am just now getting them today. So that shows you if, don't be like me, be better than me. If two-day shipping is an option for any sneaker releases moving forward while this pandemic is going on, Select it, select it, select it. I cannot stress that enough. Your boy has been bamboozled on the Royal Toes. Thank God I actually had a pair of Royal Toes already in my possession because I don't know what I would have done. Um, but nevertheless, again, DTLR came through again. Clutch for your boy. Uh, on this metallic purple uh, pair and I'm waiting on the other pair which if I had to guess I probably won't get them until I'm banking on mid-June you know so uh, that's why I'm really 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 uh, having to figure out some other options for these flints since the BS shock drop happened your boy didn't get them so I'm gonna really have to figure something out so I plan to have you know those soon uh, but other than that guys I think that's pretty much it you know that pretty much sums up the metallic purple retro force and before we get to this on feet again don't forget to like share comment subscribe and again follow your boy on IG let's get into this on feet <laughs> 